wonder did she suffer and why? Why? I, I need some closure. I really do, sir. I need the closure. The mother of a woman killed yesterday in Mid-City is searching for answers and seeking justice for her daughter. Good evening, I'm Karen Swenson. And I'm Katie Moore. Two people were killed, another shot in the 3000 block of Bienville Avenue. Paul Murphy reports New Orleans police are still searching for suspects in the deadly triple shooting. Lives were shattered in an instant when someone started shooting near the corner of Bienville and North Salcedo streets in New Orleans. I just want my daughter. I want to see her again. That's all. Florida Lazard's daughter, 40 year old Ilea Henderson, was one of two people killed in the shooting. It happened just before 5 30 Monday afternoon. Lazard says Henderson was a personal care assistant. She was struck by gunfire while sitting on a porch with her patient who uses a wheelchair. I want to find answers. I want to find comfort. I want to know why this had to happen to her. She wasn't doing nobody nothing. She was on her job. According to witnesses, two masked men dressed in black fired into a group of people on the street. They heard more than a dozen shots. This man, who did not want to be identified, said his cousin, 31-year-old Santiago Rubio, may have been the target. Rubio was also struck and killed. Real talk. You don't just shoot into no crowd and kill innocent bystanders. That's crazy, man. A third person was wounded in the shooting. His condition is unknown. Family members of the victims say somebody knows something, and the only way they're going to get closure is for someone to come forward and identify the shooter. Uh, I think it's just need to stop the violence, man. It's just getting out of hand, man. Real talk. And like, how you take my cousin from me? <laughs> and that really hit home, because I just laid my granddaughter to rest. Got killed in a car accident. <laughs> nice, my daughter. What's next? Uh, what I can't take it. I can't. <gasps> the gunman hopped in a car and drove away. Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News. If you have any information about the shooting that could help police, call Crime Stoppers at 822-1111. You do not have to give your name.